Hey, pastry puffs. It's your girl, Strudel. Absolutely terrified, mortified, and humiliated. Long story, if, like, anyone who knows me IRL wants to know what happened. Y'all see this? DM me at strudel underscore collects on Instagram, and I'll be more... More than happy to talk about it, because I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all already know, like, how your girl is very anxious and spooked out all the time, so you get to hear more about that later. <coughs> <coughs> but today is the LMG 707 Episode 5, The Lights series, and we've got, which came out in February of 2020. I don't remember the exact date because it was like a week ago that I did my research. I think it was like February 26th. So yeah, um, got that from Amazon doing my research via Google. I mean via Google. I think I have her jacket on backwards, but I don't feel like dealing with it. Because you'll see in a moment. <coughs> but today we have the Lights series, which consists of Groovy Babe, her girlfriend Angles, because they are the iconic funky lesbians, Speedster, a.k.a. Miss RuPaul, and then just, um, Dazzle. This is the very last OMG I needed when I bought, like, the last handful that I was missing, like, earlier this year. But, um, now I'm missing a handful again. But, and eh, there's not much I can do about it. <coughs> and with the Lights series, they came in, like, a smaller, a smaller box. Like, an AKA, what they were calling the budget box before... Before last year, it was a thin, like, it was a smaller box, just, like, the hair skinnier than a regular OMG box. They didn't come with shoe boxes, but they did come with a hat box, and instead of two garment bags, one. And they came with this little, um, this little black light that looked like a can of hairspray. It was black for groovy boob. Yellow for Dazzle, pink, I believe it was pink for Speedster, and I think it was yellow, I think it was like white for Angles. <coughs> <coughs> but yeah, um, for their reviews, like if you want to see the black light, watch their reviews. I still need to make a review of her, so you know what her black light looks like. But, um, if you don't, her eyebrows say neon glow on them. So with that, um, I will show y'all Groovy Babe, who was my very first Lights doll. And, actually, one of my very, one of the very first OMG dolls that I had gotten. Because I had saw her on Amazon, on Amazon, with the Amazon warehouse, where she was, like, significantly cheap. It was just her box was extremely damaged. <coughs> and when I mean extremely, it was like, oh, girl, it was broke and had to be put back together. That's how bad it was. But um, usually if y'all were wondering how Strudel gets some of her OMGs, believe it or not, a great way that I get them get some of my dolls is from the Amazon is from is used from the Amazon warehouse because most of the time like groovy babe the dolls are in great condition it's just the boxes are really fucked up <coughs> but yeah that's groovy babe oh she's the sister of beatnik babe and then we've got angles who is the sister of shapes and who also owns a black doll stand Huh. I didn't even realize that they had matching stands. Cute, funky lesbians. This is Angles, the sister of shapes, and you can tell she's got, like, this wickedly cool asymmetrical haircut. 
Do you tell like the bottom layer is like this neon green, black, and this very interesting pink color. And then most of the top is blue and it's got some hidden black streaks. And then it's got like this big white streak poking out. And then the bangs are a little asymmetrical with the green and the black being the same size, being the same height length. And then the pink ones being a shorter length. And she's got, um, you know, the, the whole asymmetrical look about her, which is like sickening. Because she looks like a massive art snob, and even though she never spoke in the House of Surprises show, she is known to be an extremely tough, like, pop culture critic, and she was like, Oh, I hate Swag's new show. No, I hate Swag's new art show. My golly god, I am such an art snob. <laughs> Sorry, that's my best impression of an art snob. I like art, but I'm not a fucking snob. So I wouldn't know what an art snob sounds like. <coughs> but um, also, I love the fact that her lipstick is four different colors. Sickening, no, and real fierce, too. And then next we have Miss Speedster, a.k.a. Miss RuPaul. From RuPaul's Drag Race. She is the sister of a gremlin named Drag Racer. And she was like the first ever OMG to come with gloves. But it's this but it's this rubber glove mold that we will be seeing more of in the future. Well, that we'll see at least one more time in the future. So keep these in the back of your head. But, um, my Speedster I would bought off of Facebook Marketplace secondhand. I'd gotten angles full price from Target.com. <coughs> but I bought, um, Speedster brand new in box secondhand. And, like, one arm is incredibly loose. One arm's, like, a bit loose. And then the other arm is cracked at the elbow joint. So... I couldn't really file a warranty claim because I bought it second hand and MGA is usually like, oh if you bought it but oh if you bought it second hand, you should have bought it retail. Yeah, but when I fucking wanted the doll, she wasn't on she wasn't available at retail anymore. How the fuck was I supposed to buy her? <sighs> Irritating, but like super cute. Love the love love the leggings. Love the leggings the best, and I love the fact that her um whole thing is half pink, half orange split dye. Not split dye, but like half and half fabrics with the checkerboard print because, you know, she's a drag racer. <coughs> so that's fun. And then last we have Dazzle with the yellow sunglasses, which double is a hair bow, and she's one of like the only... OMGs that I display with their sunglasses because, you know, sunglasses are cool, I guess. And then you can tell her little freckles are heart-shaped. Which reminds me of Neon Licious. Kind of like Neon Licious's freckles that she has, like, on her dolls. Which I do need to look at, um, Fierce Neonlicious because, um, where she is across the room, I can't really see her all that well. But if I get a better look at her face, I will show y'all. And, um, before the existence of another OMG, she was, like, the first one to have this little interesting like shrug piece to go over her little crop top and these little sleeves are detached <coughs> and she has like a set of bangles that I didn't even notice till like now because the way she is displayed on my shelf I can't really see her all that well because like y'all know how the doll shelves are displayed and then she's got this very interesting, like, gym skirt material, like, 
workout, um, gym skirt material, like, maxi pencil skirt. But the shoes are a serve. I love the shoes. And she has, like, pink and orange hair, like, neonlicious. But hers is, like, I believe the base color is pink. And it's a different pink than neonlicious is. And she's got orange streaks within the hair. And you can tell her hair is all in those, like, little multi-braids. Like, you'll get for Series 3 and whatnot. So this is what they all look like together. Like, very, very cute. Very stunning. Also, I forgot to mention, if you look at Groovy Boob's earrings, like, they actually spin. And her whole outfit is like an optical illusion. Which is insane. And I love it. <coughs> Even though I know this isn't, like, for, like, the little gremlins... For her, um, she, um, reminds me of that, um, um, trying to think of the word. One of the tots, like, the gremlins from the Lights series. One of the gremlins from the Lights series whose name is Optical, and she's in the art club. Man, that doll was, like, for a three-inch doll, that is a wicked cool doll. So, Yeah. Then, um, so anyway, not really sure what else to do because let me check the time. If it will let me check my time. Oh, there we go. So, yeah, I'm not really sure what else to say or do because today was a bit of a more, like, Lay it back one because my last my last one I was like so high off of anxiety it wasn't even fucking I wasn't even fucking ser like <coughs> I wasn't even fucking joking and then a couple of days ago I got like that ang like my anxiety got like that high again so like yeah. It's always something to make my anxiety go through the roof. And I'm, like, trying so hard not to have a fucking panic attack. Because I just don't like to be surprised. And I've said this a million times. I'm not keen on surprises. Surprises cause me stress. Stress causes me anxiety. And then, like, I get all anxious and whatnot. So, yeah, fun. But if y'all didn't know, OMG 707 is for beginners. And this was more of an overview episode. And I know it's a bit shorter than the usual episodes. It's just there isn't as much to talk about with these dolls. As they are in a slimmer box. So there's like less stuff to go over. And they are mostly partial. And they are mostly fully dressed aside from like their jackets when you buy them. <coughs> so yeah if you liked this don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one bye